Kicked dog, now sterile. He was already neutered. Stupid tabloid. Actually, this is a legitimate newspaper. So, Deep, I'm curious. Do you actually feel bad about any of this? Yes. My picture should be on the front page. Guys, focus. For today's show, I've found a charity that'll accept D as a spokesperson. It was a hard sell, and it's not the most high-profile charity in the world. Still, it's a chance to show her kind, generous side. Oh. Then maybe dog lovers will forgive her. What's the charity? I'm auctioning off all of my costume jewelry and donating the proceeds to the Athlete's Foot Foundation. Ooh. Okay, that didn't work out so well. <laughs> Maybe we've been going about this the wrong way. We have to face it head on. Admit the outrage is justified. Feed the public's taste for blood. Yes, a TV execution? I love it. I was thinking more along the lines of a public apology. Oh, no. I don't do that sorry thing very well. D, there's no other choice. We have to atone. Ugh. It's okay. I'll help you through it. We need her to show some emotion. Right. Five minutes to air, darlings! D, repeat exactly what I say. As you know, I'm usually a happy-go-lucky person. I come out here, I laugh, I joke, I make you smile, and usually it's easy. I'm a natural, I love it. But today, it's not coming naturally. Today, I feel terrible. I made, I made a, a mistake. mistake, a big mistake. <laughs> I heard a poor, defenseless dog. I didn't mean to, but I did it, and I'm sorry. So, 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 sorry, sorry, sorry. Are we done yet? Cue the tear gas. It's not working. Okay, try to think about how bad you feel when you've bought something full price, then two days later, see it on sale. Oh, God. So sorry I missed that sale. <laughs> Do you forgive me, studio audience? You still kicked the dog. Yeah. How about if I give you all a free D show keychain? <laughs> Parker, my breakdown is a hit. Ow. My fans are worried about my sanity. Can you believe it? They're sending letters, emails, even free prescription drugs. We should do this sort of thing more often. Scandal and redemption are great for PR. You were right, Parker. This whole animal stuff really showed my human side. I'm glad it worked out, Dee. Okay. Uh, hello? So, what do we have next hey. to showcase my fantastic humanity? <clears throat> Let's jam. Can't tonight. I have to go home and hang out with Massimo. Oh, suit yourself. Maybe I should get a baby seal. I've heard they're very soft. <laughs> Massimo! Massimo, I'm home! Massimo? Dear Parker, I've done a lot of thinking about what's happened these last few days, and I realized something. Your life would be better without me. I even thought the world would be better without me. <laughs> but please don't worry. I'll be fine. I was raised on the streets. I can fend for myself. I'm a tough mutt. Love you, Parker. Oh, Massimo. Have you seen this dog? You seen a dog? He's small. He likes to mime. Have you seen a dog? Massimo? Where are you, Massimo? Here you are. Yuck! I can see you. La la la, I can hear you. Massimo, listen to me. Parker, go. 
Just forget about me. Forget that I ever existed. It will take time, years maybe, but try to forget. I've wrecked your life for the last time. You didn't wreck my life, Mass. You've made it better since the first day we met. Remember? Yeah, I remember. <laughs> you like that? I call that the Mars Walk, because it's like you're walking on the moons of Mars. Mars Walk! <laughs> I'll take that one. He's funny. You spoke to me. You really spoke to me. Plus, you're a great mime artist. Y you think? I mean, really? But didn't you lose your job? Yeah, and what are we gonna eat? No, everything's totally fine. I didn't lose my job. I overreacted. I'm sorry. I'm sorry too, Park. Are you ready to go home now? Yeah, the food is awful in here. We'll pick up some doggy tikka masala on the way home. Ooh, can we get Nan? In a shocking turn of events, Dee redeemed herself today with a public breakdown, admitting fault for kicking that poor defenseless dog. But the story doesn't end there. It doesn't? No, it doesn't. Well-known daytime talk show host Victoria Lafayette has not scooped her kitty litter in two whole days. Ew! The hazardous waste crew have just arrived on the scene. My God, I can't watch anymore. What? That bitch! She probably leaked the story herself. But Dee, aren't you happy that we're off the hot seat and people like you again? No. Who do I have to kick to get back in the spotlight? Mm. No, 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 no! Ow! Okay, maybe it's the kick in the equipment, or the morphine after the kick in the equipment. But pet people are totally nuts. When's somebody gonna tell that story? People love animals, Simon. I like my dog more than I like most people. What? And that's healthy? Treating your dog like a friend? Hey, Massimo, what's up? Wanna shoot some pool and hang out? Have a couple of beers and chit-chat? <laughs> <laughs> I'm starting to understand why Dee kicked it. <laughs> <laughs> Ow.